Hello everybody, welcome back to the Maxi. Let me just check to make sure this is working and recording. Yep. Okay. <clears throat> right. Bought a few things. And if you remember I said about the the um, exhaust clamp kit. Well, it came. This is how it came. Nothing in it. Because the box had completely broke open from the top because the guy what parceled it didn't put no tape around here. The items inside are very heavy and it tore the paper open and Royal Mail sent it in this lovely little bag. So they stuck it in there and had the cheek to say when I delivered it to the door, your parcel got squashed. Let alone that there's sod all in it. So, unfortunately, no exhaust clamp kits, so I had to get a refund. That took ages. Um, what else have I got? Well, I've already opened this one, because this came the other day as well. And if you remember, I said I managed to get the mirror to match the other side of the car. The only thing that's different is the lens, but you can unscrew these. So this one is exactly the same as what's on the door. So I'm looking forward to putting this one on, to get it so it matches the other side because like you lost you lost without a mirror really on the passenger side for parking and whatnot, and you don't know or not if you've got a push bike or a motorbike coming down on the inside of you, and you go to turn left or something and you're not checking your mirrors. I mean I I usually check my mirrors and I turn my head. That's only if the if the car got plenty of glass to see through. Um, on some cars you got our job to. Just, to you know turn your head and to see anything because pillars and everything now the, the cars today the glass is getting smaller and the pillars are getting thicker um yeah so that's arrived so i got that that arrived last week so i got that sorry for the noise this is what i've been waiting for this one so this one just arrived today around about dinner time ish Unfortunately, I haven't been able to do any work on the Maxi at the moment because I've been uh, doing my Rover 75 because I had to do some MOT work on it. Get it ready, for, well, get it ready for MOT. So, let's get into this cover. It's well packaged. Let's bring you up just a tiny bit. I know some of you enjoy watching me uh, opening these parcels and to see what I bought for the car. And some of you, you know, I don't put it down as part seven or part eight or anything like that sort of thing. I just put it down as a parcel reveal for the Maxi. Okay, so that's one not off. Okay, where are we now on this? Ah, right, here we go. Sharpen this now. Right. And okay. All right, you then. <laughs> it's in its original box. It's just a bit tatty. So it is in its original box. <laughs> All right, you then. So it's got a bit squashed. I'm surprised Royal Mel didn't think they damaged it themselves uh, hopefully she'll come out of there I've really got sharp in this now definitely got sharp in it uh, yep this is what I've been waiting for and there she is I don't think there's anything else in it. So I've been waiting for this. Uh, hair, no, uh, yeah, air filter, performance air filter. Now some of you are probably thinking, why would I want a performance air filter? Well the reason is, 
just a bit smaller to put on the car and you can clean these filters so I mean you can take them out clean them in petrol or if your wife goes out and you've got the house to yourself you can always stick it in the dishwasher if you're brave enough without getting caught and that you could do it that way but um I just washes them out in paraffin or petrol or anything like that and you can just keep reusing them and reusing them so they're a lot more there's a lot more easier than um mucking about trying to find the the other ones so it's not actually fitting on there properly at the moment because it's in a big but uh, yeah it, it fits on there like that and then you've got these metal inserts to go inside so yeah cool and that's metal not a piece of plastic so yeah so that's that so that's what i've been waiting for at the moment um ordered some mud flaps genuine ones proper maxi ones they're second hand but they should be all right it should tidy up and go on the car okay uh so i won't bother reviewing that unless i got any more parcels coming i mean i haven't ordered anything else at the moment because like i said i've been busy uh getting the mot ready for my rover 75 because um I had that six month extension but that's now run out now so I need to um, pull my finger out and get it ready get it for the next MOT so that's that so I got a mirror an empty box and an air filter so basically like I said this came today the mirror came last week along with my empty box which was meant to be an exhaust clamp kit so which means now I got to again and find the exhaust clamp kit again or just have to buy them separately but the trouble is I mean that was only five pounds see that exhaust clamp kit and that came with the brackets I needed and uh, well if you look on eBay they're not very cheap I mean you're pricing them off I mean they're like eight pounds something just for one for one bracket which is a rubber with uh, two threads on the end um, so yeah so that stuff that I do anyway all I can say is a big thank you to have everybody who subscribed to my channel on the build on the Maxi. So I will be going to do some more work on it soon. It's just on hold for a minute because I need to get my other car MOT'd. Um, and a big thank you to all my new friends on Facebook who decided to from from who wanted to be my friend due to having a Maxi and whatnot. Uh, so a big thank you to all you all you lot as well that's uh, cheered me up at knowing that I got some new friends um, who are interested in the same hobby as me because that's what it is really is hobby I mean you know we like old cars and stuff like that and we quite enjoy the maxi and um, I'm thinking about giving the car see that's fitting on there nice, nicely mate. once you squish it down a bit but that's got a bag on it um, I'm thinking about giving the car a name and because the car brings back a lot of memories for me as childhood because it was my mum and stepdad were always had a maxi because it was um, our daily commuter as, as well as our business well well as their business car because uh, it was used as a taxi so that just shows how old I'm going back and um, and I mean a taxi taxi I don't mean like a taxi for the family I mean an actual taxi so it was used as a taxi as well as taking the family everywhere and as well as um, doing everything else like with our mum my mum was a singer so all the singing equipment had to go in the back of it so the back of these maxis are brilliant they got so much room in the boot you can do what you want in them um, so all the music equip equipment used to go in the back so I'm gonna call her after my mum Beryl so I'm going to give her a name. I don't usually give any car a name. I mean, usually I look at it, a car has got a name. It's Rover or Maxi or whatever like that. Like, but I'm going to call her Beryl after me mum. And um, because basically at the end of the day, I mean, the, most of the money, what I bought the car out of was out of my inheritance money from, from my mum's estate. So I'll, um, I'm going to call her Beryl. So, yeah. 
So a big thank you to everybody, and I, well, I can't thank you enough, really. I mean, you've been all very supportive over this maxi, and I absolutely love it. Thank you very much indeed. Um, yeah, so I'm waffling on again. So if I get any more serious parcels turn up, like mechanical parts, brakes, or anything like that, then I'll show you what else I've got as well. Because I haven't looked into the braking system, not yet. I'm just picking up little bargains as I go along. I mean, this one expensive, and the mirror was about the only expensive thing, but it was the only one I could find on eBay at the time, and I thought I'd better grab it. So, that was that. But, I mean, the, the exhaust lamp kit, I mean, that was only a fiver, but unfortunately I got an empty box. So, there we are. Anyway, thank you, thank you, thank you. So, ta-ta for now. Stay tuned.